Hello everyone, this is Jeffrey T. Tiller back with another service management leadership video. We thank you for joining us as we've had lots of videos this year to we're probably approaching 1200 on our YouTube channel. That's a lot. It's a lot for me and my, uh, uh, my voice over the years. So today I wanna to talk about CMDB and have our last one of the year about CMDB, our last CMDB video of the year. And before that, I wanted to thank you for joining us if you viewed all of ours this year. And I also want to ask that you like and share the video, subscribe to the channel, check out our podcast and follow our LinkedIn company page. All right, so from the time a configuration item is brought online for the first time, needing a change request, please do that so you remain compliant. From that time all the way through to when it's decommissioned, it's the CI life cycle, right? And you need to understand that life cycle very well in your service management roles because you need to understand, do we have too many in one life cycle stage or state? Or do we have need more here? How long do we keep the decommissioned ones on this? How long do we decommission them and they still can be found on the network? These are all relative and great questions that you have to decide for your organization. Also, and this is the key takeaway, I advise you to have a process, and I don't mean that in a literal way, but metrics with a way of handling CIs for each state within the life cycle, right? Each status. Because the way you, you handle these, these procedures, the way you handle something that's coming online is different. Think from a patching point of view. You have to handle everything a little bit differently. Think about from a security point of view. We have to handle it differently. We have to be able to report on it. So as a CI, like an asset, has a life cycle. Think how for each status can you handle it optimally. If service management leadership can help your organization in this or another area, let me know. We'd love to help and I hope you have an awesome day.